and then, you know, play some Witcher 3 maybe tomorrow. It's perfect! Level 19, shoot. Oh, I was like, I have a hat on? That's right. I have the the cowl. Cool cowl looking thing. I do like those colors too. Well, the rogue armor like always looks good on the Inquisitor. I feel like the out of everything, the rogue armor looks the best. Because for one thing, you get that freaking awesome like Inquisition chest plate. I don't think any of the other specialties get that cool chest plate. And I would think that the warrior of all of them would get that, and they don't. None of the Vanguard armor I ever got. I always hated the way it looked on my elf. Like, I did not like it. Oh, uh, shoot. Dexterity, melee defense. Oh, I have guard penetration too, and attack. Oh, cool. Uh... I could get the belt focus. No, oh, but I have. That's right. I have the grenades belt. Let's give Solus. Well, Solus is doing great. Solus does not need melee defense. I think um, because he has the guard thing. So we'll give that to you, buddy, old pal. So I know the potions belt was useful, but my love, you need to stay alive a little longer. What is it? The it's ten percent melee defense. Cool. Sandra, what do you, she has the enhanced guard belt. Plus 20 max guard. That's pretty freaking rad. But, or you could give her 10% stagger. Or like a 10% chance to stagger or whatever. Mm, nah, it's all good. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, that was scary. That was scary. Oh, I think that's the way to keep going. Wow, like, can I save now? Oh my gosh, that was... I've never gotten to this point. I have no idea what to do. Like, wow. Oh, is the camp just in there? Well, is, can I get in through this hole? Nope. Oh, okay. And not in there, I presume? All right. Whew. That was exciting. Well, next time I'm doing this before Solus leaves with my main Inquisitor, with my Canon Inquisitor, I guess you could say. Wow. Hey, hey, isn't that sky? You should probably not see that. Dorian's like, I'm so tired right now. That's the last of those dark spawn. Legion's in your debt, Inquisitor. Dude, look at this, Ren. That was insane. It's ancient. Maybe a thousand years old. Any idea who built it or why? This tig is on top of a lyrium mine. According to the memories, the mine was destroyed by some unexplained disaster. The miners must have used this lift to reach the lower levels. I'm starting to see a trend. <laughs> if there is a titan causing earthquakes, it's down there. I found this book with the emissary. The pages are mostly ruined. With the emissary? Are readable. See this line? I awoke to the singing stone. Our kingdom trembled at the titan's hymn. Hmm. Oh, I'm so excited. That reference to singing stone... I've been told that raw lyrium has a sound. A hum. The mining cast follows it to find lyrium veins. Oh. They say it's the stone calling to them. Perhaps it wasn't chance that the quakes destroyed lyrium mines. Oh. Well, that's a really good point. Talon is so smart. Is it possible the Darkspawn or their emissary could also hear the song? The stone would never call to those vile things. But that doesn't mean they can't hear her. 
Darkspawn live and die by the Blight. They don't care for much else. I didn't realize you knew so much about Darkspawn motives. Not everything's a mystery, Volta. Some things are exactly as they Volta. appear. Volta, that's her name. And some things are not. Oh. We need more information. How can we be sure what the book says is true? We shouldn't force connections that don't exist. Perhaps this will change your mind. Look it's here. good to be a skeptic. It's the royal seal of Orsek Garal. King Orsek Garal? That book belonged to a paragon? Maybe you are on the something, Volta. Of course you take a dead man's word over mine. Always the traditionalist. Ho ho! Hey, challenging tradition lost you a cushy position in Orzammar. Ah. I thought she chose to do this. I thought there was a letter up at the main Inquisition camp here in the Deep Rose that was a letter from her father to her saying, like, I wish you could come back or something. Does a king's book mean that much to you, Ren? Paragons are the best of our people. They don't hand that title out to just anyone. Not even yeah, a king. Yeah, but sometimes they go crazy. Knowing Garal's book from the start would have saved us an argument. As if you'd ever avoid an argument. Nah. Uh... What does he mean you lost your position? I thought you were a shaper. Not all shapers have the same duties. Mine were adjusted. There are some when that have to go with the Legion. ordered me to remove an official record from the memories, I declined. We decided it would be best if I served the shaper it here, finding history instead of recording it. Oh. That record must have been important risk your position over it. To, it see, that's, trivial, that's the problem. Actually. Well, that's the problem with reshaping Malen history. had ancestral ties to the Carta. But the truth is the truth, no matter how political it may be. Exactly. That's the problem. The Shaperit can erase official records. Aren't the memories permanent? Sometimes erasing records is standard procedure. If a dwarf becomes castless, they're struck from the memories. But I was asked to change a fact that someone important merely found inconvenient understandable yesterday's all the rage is today's embarrassment <laughs> Tori is the best uh, Talon is just like oh yes <laughs> the that's is my lover <laughs> what would prevent them from covering up the existence of Titans why would they do that because someone in power because it was inconvenient the shaper it does disappoint me I had no idea the shaper it was so corrupt Institutions aren't corrupt, only people. I wish abusing memories for political gain was a rarity. I remember Orzammar as an honorable kingdom. You've been gone a long time, Ren. I'm sorry I brought it up. The earthquakes are what matters. I don't know where this lift leads, but plus, you know, rose-tinted glasses to find out and the all. Hard way. Get ready. Wait, 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 wait! I missed it. I just missed that last line. He said, we're going to find something out the hard way. Responding. Text message. Yes. Okay. Ah! Oh, my goodness. Freaking gracious. These tomes were pristine before the deep roads. Shaper's deep is going to kill me. Um... He already asked about these. You seem quite excited by the idea. My connection. Titans? We call ourselves children of the stone. What does that I wonder mean to then. You like how pale she is compared to Scout? You know, it's true, actually. Like, I did notice, like, I was like, she's actually really pale, but her hair is really dark and her makeup's really dark. And that's true, because she's. I mean, she's. She's never seen the surface, she's never seen the sun. That's a good point. Um... Thanks for the insight, Shaper. My pleasure, Inquisitor. We'll speak another time. Okay. Best way to get out Darkspawn stains? Vroog. It's a Legion secret. <laughs> uh... We already asked all these. Thanks for your time. I don't even... Like, freaking... Wait. Okay. Okay. And Solus and 
Dorian and Sandra's good. Okay. Wow. Wow. Hmm. I think I have read this before. <laughs> the Chantres believe that the Darkspawn origins are nonsense. Perhaps at the very heart of our world is the Queen, the First Mother. Instead of focusing on the children, we should target the Broodmothers and ensure that future reinforcements will never be born. Right in the margins are two sets of hand writing, presented to be from Lieutenant Ren and Shaper Valta. Chopping off their heads should do the trick. <laughs> Write in one of my books again, and it's your head at risk, Lieutenant. Cute. Me? Why, thank you. Why, thank you. You are too kind. This place is massive. All right, well. Oh, I I missed that gate because I didn't have enough I didn't have enough gears. Darn it. So do we want to go up or down? Oh, it looks like we want to go down, but what's up here? Hmm. Stuff is up here. Another door that I probably don't have enough gears for. I stopped scanning the area around me and probably missed some. Oh, look at that. Another sunbow. It'd be cool if this one was like... Ah, look! A mug! Oh my gosh! This cup is cracked. It's cool in action and no longer holds ale without leaking. Everett's experience. Oh my gosh! There is something unpleasant behind that door. Oh, there's a Nope, oh it's Summerstone. Thought it was thought it was a gear. Nope, nope, I'm trying to go forward actually. Anything No. Nope. Do you have to go to work? <laughs> Come down with a case of man flu. It should call in sick. And oh my gosh, cause you, cause you have to go to work in the morning, don't you? Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh yeah, you gotta be careful. <laughs> that that man flu is pretty horrid. I've heard. <laughs> uh, my character, Talon, get back up here. I'm not going down there. Where did he go? <laughs> yeah, oh my gosh. I appreciate your sacrifice. If nothing else, if you have to go to work, just know that I am thinking of you while you have to suffer <laughs> and that I appreciate your sacrifice. <laughs> I legitimately do. I know. I understand. That is... Whew, that is intense. Oh my gosh. I can't believe <laughs> you're doing that. <laughs> Uh, oh wait, let's go to valuables. Um, get rid of that. Come on. Talon. Now I'm a little bit freaked out. Because if I boop to him, then everybody else is going to as well. Where did he go? <laughs> I know, right? In for a penny, in for a pound, I guess. <laughs> oh, man. I got I to gotta get through this DLC for you. Oh, five. Oh, my gosh. I do not have enough. Well, where did... Where did Talon go? 
My Inquisitor has disappeared. Well, friggin'. Oh, there he is. Now he's back. Friggin'. He just took a friggin' nap. I wonder if there's gears around here. Oh, God. That was. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> A gear over here. It's like the most obvious slash inobvious place to put one. Eh. Ah, Solus is like, I ain't going over there. <laughs> well, what? The oh, well, oh, well, oh, it's Summerstone. Cool. Oh, but apparently there's something else. Okay. All right, down to the lift. Down we go. Oh, come on. Quick, everyone jump on, it's moving. Oh, look at you, beautiful boy. I am not a dwarf, I am an elf. I am like, please don't make me go down there, please. I have to feel he'd think like that. Like, I think humans would be a little bit uncomfortable with this too, or really uncomfortable. But an elf is like made of like sky and sun, like, especially a Dalish elf. Like, you just, this is not, this is not your location. And he didn't, Talon didn't like the fade either when he went. Here we go. Oh, what? <laughs> Why are we going somewhere? <laughs> Ooh. <gasps> wow. Pretty. What was that? I don't know. What? Something moved. There. Light a torch. So I can see us coming. Just stay close. What? The best elevator music ever. Oh my gosh, when he pulled out his bow. What? Is that? Oh, like eyes? Different. Stale. <laughs> We've gone past the deep roads. How can you tell? It's pitch black. What are they? I can see them! There's a shape in there! Oh my gosh! Oh! They're not just eyes! They're not... practically blind down here. I don't wish to alarm anyone, but I believe we've all gone blind. What are they? I can see a. F That's what was laughing earlier. Why do we have? Oh, because we're like in battle mode. Oh my gosh. Okay, I was. I have to take a bathroom break really fast. If this is gonna scare me, then I need to. <laughs> I need to go for a second. I'll be right back. Don't say it's behind me. No. Candy break. Tea break here. <laughs> Yay! I'm glad. It was break time. It was. It was time. It was a good time. Candy break. Yep, you win. Of all the breaks, yours is the best. Candy break. So apparently, my my dad, since I live at home, he actually left the house to go find Wi-Fi because I asked them not to use the Wi-Fi. <laughs> I'm like, that's actually really sweet. <laughs> oh, man. I'm like, oh, I'll have to get them all, like, cookies or something. I don't know. That's really nice. Now they're all having to talk and stuff. They're like, oh, my gosh. I'm like, remember back in the day when we all didn't have cell phones? It's like that. <laughs> Fun times. Kind of, like, scoop my chair forward, but I don't want to. 
<laughs> I know, poor dad. <laughs> he played a little bit of Pokemon Go, apparently. Uh, he doesn't play it, but he, my sister has an account on his phone. And so he caught her, like, 20 Pokemon. I was like, oh, there you go. Getting out, getting some fresh air. Chatting with people <laughs> instead of just playing on the phone. Everyone's having to go back to the old days. I feel like we're about to light candles. Okay. Ah! Stop it! Explore the forgotten... I can't, I mean, literally, I, I'm trying to like... Whoa! I was like, I'm trying to lean forward and then it went dark. Oh my gosh. What are you? Are you like good or bad, little things? I. Are they. <gasps> no! No! Show yourself! They're not. They're not children, are they? They're lyrium things. They gotta be something else. <gasps> joined the Legion to pay his father's debts. It kept his mother and brother from losing their caste. The poor and desperate here often sacrifice themselves for their family's future. Ren was a good man. We'll honor his sacrifice. He always seemed indestructible. Wow. These warriors. There's lyrium woven directly into the metal, and it's bonded to their skin. I liked Ren. Impossible to remove, but 
but I know what we'd find underneath. These are dwarves. Ren was killed by our own kind. They don't look like any dwarves I've ever met. Me neither. It just doesn't make sense. We've done nothing to them. I won't leave Ren like this. We must return him to the stone. Thrust oh. and shot. Saroka. I'm sorry. I'll see this through, Ren. I promise. Oh, well, that was sad. Anything standing between us and the Titan will regret it. Ah, uh, well, there's that. Ugh. I am sorry. Well, did he just disappear? That's kind of... I thought it'd be kind of interesting to see uh, an actual, like, dwarven burial instead of burning them. I'd like to see one take place. Why do these guys only have money? I want to pick up their weapons. What the heck kind of weapons were those? If Varric was down here, he'd be like, what the heck? I thought he was indestructible too. Yeah, like he, he was cool. Like, I don't know, he had the funniest story. Of course, right? He talked too much. He had too many funny stories. He was too personable. Yeah, he was doomed. He was doomed. Did she already go? Wow, oh no, okay, she's, where's Dorian? Oh, Dorian! Oh, <laughs> he's just, look at, Dorian's been possessed! Oh my gosh! <laughs> he's like twitching! Oh my gosh! He's blinking and his face is moving, but he's... Okay, uh, I couldn't have you like that anymore, Dorian. Oh my gosh, that was, that was, oh boy. Target enemies? Somehow. I think if you uh, press the left and right bumpers at the same time, you can have your entire crew aim at your same thing. Or you can just use this. Attack my target type thing. Thank you, Solus. I forgot you had that ability. That was the reason, one of the reasons I brought you, but it, I forgot you had it. Holy crap. Oh, there's another one. One of the ones that used to be our friend, but is no longer. Shoot, having a, an item, oh, I see you. I swear I saw another one. Oh, um, like, 
I mean, I could use this mode. Yeah, I could use. Whoa. Shaw Brittle Stone Stalker. Level 18. Are you still alive? I think you are. No? No, you've got zero health. Yeah! I don't ever use this! I never use it! <laughs> I like it, but I've, uh, I have like the idea, but I almost never use it. I think I would if I was given more of an option on tactics, but since I'm not, I'm like, everybody just do your thing! Everybody seems to be pretty capable, you know? So... And there's almost no reason for me to use it. I suppose I could use it more... I, if I want to pause the battle, I end up just, like, uh, pressing the potions button and looking around and trying to figure out what I want. But, yeah, that would be a good idea. I should maybe use it more. Let's... How many... Okay, we're not too bad. Oh, man. So, I mean, how was... What, Ren, Ren sensed it, too, didn't he? It's not just Valta's stone sense, but she seems to be especially attuned or something. Why am I just picking up gold from these guys? Save! I'm gonna... Ha! Ah! Okay, see, this is what... I think what I've been trying to do, because sometimes I go into this screen, I think what I've been trying to do sometimes is go into this. A Kratal? Uh, you are immune to being panicked, physical effects, sundered, and weakened. That's great. That's great. You're fire vulnerable. Good thing we have Dorian. Come closer, cowards. I have to see what your stats are. I really should use this more. Ooh, look at this. Look at this. Thank you for reminding me about this camera. Look at that, it's like a little fly cam. Boop, 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 boop. What's down there, I wonder? The Titans! Okay, actually, let me give... Dorian needs to have a... And... We'll let Solus be the walking regeneration, dude. Right now. I always, like, my first playthrough... Not evil, just misunderstood. Oh, are they misunderstood bunnies? Oh, shoot. Well, they're killing people without asking. They're not even saying, like, here's our demands. They're just, like, killing us. I'm sure they've got a reason, though. Is there any way to confuse one? Uh... All right. that work? Oh my gosh, it worked. It worked! I confused them! Oh my gosh, I can't believe I did that! Wow! Alright, well, I kind of wish I could hit these guys. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Like, I know they're gonna turn on me eventually. Wow, they're fast! Solus! Solus is my only one, that, at least that I notice anyway, that doesn't... That will get stuck sometimes. He stops attacking. Kratol. I'm gonna look at, I'm gonna look at that codex entry. Um... Oh, wrong thing. Okay, um, codex. I haven't checked this in ages. Briala. Um, nope, I don't want to look at characters. Creatures. Whew. Corpse. 
Fog Fisher, Dark Spawn Emissary. Never experience. Uh, uh. Oh, well, who was it? Um, who was it? Was it like humans or? So, an expert from the excerpt from the Blighted Codex, classified collection of studies on the Dark Spawn, held safely in the Imperial Library in Manrathus, available only to the members of the Magisterium. Yikes! Dark Spawn, the brightest of their age, were no longer men but monsters. Yep, I remember reading that ages ago. Great all! Hey, there it is! Long before the first tides, legend speaks of the Kratol, horned war beast with eyes like molten silver. Possessing the might of three Brontos, the Kratol charged their prey using a rock hard frill to smash their targets to a bloody pulp. The Kratol held down their prey with four strong legs, quickly stripping their victim's flesh from the bone with powerful jaws. Despite their brutality, some Kratol were domesticated, okay, as fierce weapons in battle. What happened to these savage creatures is unknown. Some people claim that Darkspawn wiped them out. Others say they never existed. Those with more imagination speculate that these magnificent creatures retreated deep within the earth in search of the deadliest prey. Huh. So they are like... They were hunting Darkspawn? Or something worse. If they ate Darkspawn, they would, they would, they would be sick. Dragon. Piles of gold. Well, do we have an entry for... The other guy? Or the other guys, I guess? The... Whatever they are? I don't even know what they are. Ghoul. Horror. Herlock. Herlock Alpha. Nug. Me. I love that mage is like in the creatures. But then again, so is Red Templar and stuff like that. Phoenix, Poison Spider, Pride Demon, Prowler, Quillback, Red Templar Knight. Red Templar Ram. Hmm. Looks like the Darkspawn stuff is up. Uh, what? Nope, there's a shriek. Sarah found a bloody and shaky. We asked what happened, but only got incoherent mumbling. Sarah isn't taking it well. She's close to Tarkin's family and fears how Magister Nata Ntezi will react when we deliver what's left of her son. I still have hopes his mind will recover. Tarquin needs rest and wine, that's all. It's been a f nearly a fortnight, but Tarquin is showing progress. He no longer rocks, knees tied against his chest on the bed. Yesterday, he even let Sarah hold his hand. The mumbling has since turned to silence, but I think words will come soon. We sent another unit down to investigate. Unsurprisingly, evidence of a bloodbath greeted them. Sarah believes Tarquin's unit was ambushed, half-eaten bodies, and angry runes, ru wounds from crude weapons point towards Darkspawn. Tarquin spoke today. Only one word, but it was enough. Shriek, shriek, shriek. Sarah held him as the shaking returned. Another excerpt from the Blighted Codex. Ugh, oh, the shrieks. I, dude, like... Oh, I, in Origins, they were my least favorite out of everything. Arcane Horrors, yeah, they sucked. Revenants, yeah, they sucked. Freak, everything sucked, but Shrieks could demolish me. Oh, it was, if, if I encountered a Shriek, I knew, if I, I, if we encountered a pack of Shrieks, I knew we weren't going to make it. It was, that was just, that was just the way it was. There was no way. Hmm, all right, well, maybe they're not creatures, maybe, I guess. All right. Codex updated archers, codex, oh, because I got the, up, uh, the things. I love this music, holy crap. So, you see Solus' head? <laughs> it's glowing green. <laughs> His bald head is glowing green. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna make sure to give him this. Ira kid can't resist him anyway. That music, though, will just make it even harder. Whoa, Dorian! You look really cool. Dorian would probably hate this. He would probably hate rock armor. Oh, there is stuff. Okay. Oh! Well... I mean, 
mean, I, I won't say no to money, but still, I prefer more interesting things. Oh, a book! Chronicles of a Forgotten War. No, me Woo, my favorite kind of thing. Commander Olfan told us to move out. He didn't give details, only that there had been attacks north of Kad Halash, and the Crown was sending reinforcements. Father grabbed our axes and we were off. I was a boy then, puffed up from a few victories in the Provings. I didn't know it was going to be taken from me, but I would find out. The journey to Kad Halash, Halash was long and tiresome. Bored warriors make for poor drunks at camp. Father and I kept to ourselves, though I admit I longed to lose myself in a pint of ale, if only to have something to do other than sharpen my axe. Oh, that's it? You aren't giving me anything else? Oh, this reminds me a bit of Dragon Age 2 when we have to go into the deep roads with Nathaniel. That was, that was a strange little deep roads. Whoa, 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 I saw those runes. This is like the Wall of Memories in Orzammar, but ancient, very ancient. The words seem based in Dwarven, but I barely recognize this dialect. Can you translate any of it? Only fragments. The language is very different from what we speak today. That's how 2,000 years is more than enough time. Shah Bratal. Yeah, yeah. I believe it means revered defenders. That's quite a long stewardship. They attacked us because they're protecting something. E Satanal. E Satanal. Cut our tongues, entomb our bodies, watch over the Titan until it stirs. Oh, Talon's eyes look beautiful. So the warriors who attacked us must be the Shabratal, and they're protecting a Titan. Are you all right, Volta? She's right. I can you know? hear Ren's objections. Yeah. Yeah. Let's keep moving. If more of these memories exist, they may have the answers we need. I understand. She's, I mean, if she's right, then she can't be like, her and Ren can't, like, you know, argue about it or anything, you know? There's a lyrium infused bow in there. Shoot. Wow, target explodes for 100% weapons damage. S 
not. Uh, no, this bow, the bow I've got currently is special with a 10% chance to use hidden blades. That's just. Uh, but the, let's see what it looks like. Oh, it looks just like my bow. It is my bow. Oh. Too bad the sun bow isn't that good. It's really cool looking. Well, that one was really cool looking. It was really dark. Uh, look at all these we can't use. <laughs> no, no. Oh, that's just, yeah. Okay, toss that one. Oh, I forgot to make Dorian a staff. I thought I, I thought I had made him one. I forgot he had. I mean, it was a good one, but. Uh, 58. Yeah, it's the best of what we've got so far. I can, like, hear drums in the distance. It's kind of creepy. Whoa! Oh my gosh! I love that, like, whatever that is, that, the, the, the strap across his chest thing. That looks really cool. Uh, oh, but Solus. Solus looks so good. Ow. Okay, it's not the playthrough where I'm romancing Solus. Again, Dorian, I think all I have to, I think even the blue velvet looks pretty good. Jeez. Mm -hmm. Why is my phone so loud? <laughs> well, freaking heck. I, that's gorgeous. What does it have? Does it have... It has empty everything, too. Cool. Cool. Don't mind, Dorian. He's just gonna change really quick. I'll only watch. Don't worry, Dorian. Yes, can I help you, Titan? Oh shoot, was there... There was stuff over there. Can we jump in the water? Yay, we can jump in the water. Oh, holy crap! And they hid one in the... Waterfall. Shoot, which way are we supposed to go? Let's see. Go left. Up here. Ah, everyone's like, oh, we could go a more reasonable way. No, no. This is the cooler way. Wow, this guy did not do a very good job at spreading him around. Who is laughing? It might not be, um... Look at all those deep road saves I have. Uh, it might not be... The Sharatal, because they might actually... If, if, I'm, if, I, if I'm reading into, like, the symbolism correctly, they are entombed because they have entombed themselves into their armor, and if they have cut their tongues out, as it, if, if that's the literal translation of that phrase, where they have actually cut their tongues out, then they they can scream, but not quite not quite as effectively. There's something strange on the other side. I can feel it. Watch your step. <laughs> the ground. Gears galore, yeah. Someone sabotaged the bridge, and we don't have time to fix it. Someone does not wish to be disturbed. There must be another way. There. His voice! Careful. His voice! It would... Ah. Uh, 
I mean, I want to bring him out more with Talon, but I've been trying to kind of bring other people out because I bring solos out all the time with Erica, with my other Inquisitor. But it's just, he just sounds like the kind of guy that when you listen to him talk, you listen to him talk. Like, he knows what he's talking about. He sounds, he just sounds very wise. Freaking, I love that voice. I can't even handle it. Dude, that's like mesmerizing. Like, I could like drop into that and just probably die, but a horrible death, but it might be nice. Huh? Freaking gears everywhere. Making me drop down on the dangerous places. I'll go. Slippery slopes. A day after leaving Cat Halash, we noticed a change. The deep roads were practically abandoned. Torches would suddenly go out, leaving us to stumble through the dark and trip over discarded caravans. Then came the attack, hard and fast. Father was one of the first. We heard breathing, slow and heavy, from a creature much larger than us. Father held out his arm and grabbed the front of my armor to make me stop. I saw its shadow move, darker than the darkness, and then my body jerked forward. It left father's arm hanging, still grasping my chest plate. Oh, God. Oh, my gosh. That's horrible. I got the very vivid imagery. Holy crap. 